Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Wizardry 8. I'm getting back into uh, the game with another session, and I just noticed that there were some uh, sling bullets there. So uh, let's go ahead and do that. Uh, I have gotten uh, some tips on yes. various stuff. And come on, pop out. Thank you. Uh, let's see. So I suppose you don't really need that. All right, let's see. So there was a... All right, 138 out of 182, 66 out of 166, 112, 220, 56 out of 80, 84, 212, 122 out of 307. So uh, we're, we're doing fine on weight limit, uh, which the party uh, equipment is distributed across everyone. Um, so there's that. Uh, I believe that there is an option to ah, inspect item. Okay. Let's see. Is this based on character? No? Alright. I think I was told that uh, using the inspect item would uh, inspect it and possibly uh, re-identify it if Stats have gone up since uh, the time that we got it. Not sure if that is the case. I may have misread. Oh, okay. Nope. It, that is the case. All right. So, uh, potion of cure, lesser condition. All right. So, that does do that. Uh, let's go ahead and inspect everything, see if we can figure out anything. Uh, cure poison. So I will probably just periodically do this, uh, like, maybe in between episodes or something like that. I'm not sure if it matters who I am, like, currently on, but I think that uh, uh, Olive has the highest skill. Cherry Bomb, okay. Um, blazing Fireballs burn opponents within the range of the detonation spot. Okay. So we have a throwable Fireball spell. It's good to know. Moderate healing. And that's about it. Okay. Alright, so we were able to identify a few things. That's uh, that's pretty handy. Um, let's go ahead... Oh, Olive's artifact skill increased to uh, 16. Pretty nice. Alright, well, let's uh, go ahead and proceed to the upper monastery. <coughs> that's just uh, going down, yeah. All right, so I could Anyone use. Anyone here? Yoo-hoo! How strange! There's not a soul here. Perhaps they're on a holiday or something. I heard something. Also, maybe we shouldn't be shouting at. Uh, you know, when we come in and stuff like that. I'm just saying, might not be the best idea we've ever had. There are some uh, crates. So people Spotted were. Spotted a creature. They don't look tough at all. Thank you. A rabid rat. Okay. Well, that has 29 hit points. That's a. It's awful lot. All right. Well, uh, let's go ahead and move. Very well. Oh. Well, hi. I guess we don't need to move. Never mind. Wow, six damage from a rabid rat. These rats have a lot of hit points. All right, I do need to uh, change my party formation around. I had a recommendation on a better party formation, so I'll go ahead and do that after this. You want to stop attacking, Min? 
suppose I should... Oh, wait. You're... Why are you still using your bow? That's not what I wanted. That's not what I want either. There we go. And you ran out of your, uh, ranged weapons. So I'll do something about that. Sure. Mmm. Giblets. Olive's bow skill increased to two. Olive's range skill increased. Bobo's ranged combat skill increased. Pretty nice. All right, so the recommendation was, let's see. Yes? You get back there. Yes. Yes. What is your will? Let's go ahead and put all there. Yes. Put you there. Present. Put you there. That way, everyone should switch to um, Very so. So. melee combat. Yes. And you need to use the bow. I mean, not the bow, the sling. There we go. Okay. So they did not leave any items, they just exploded everywhere. Is that supposed to be a window? Potential danger that here. That is a window. Oh, hello. Is there an item over there? Ah, yes. More sling stones. So there are two passages. It's just a series of boxes there. Some grass there. Well, we know that there's some monsters here. Look at that creature. Hello. Battle. How exciting. Go ahead and move. Okay. Might not be the best positioning for me. Some rats are advancing. Okay. Well, now they're gnar rats. Well, they don't have as many hit points. If you say so. Get ready for another walk. Of course, they might advance automatically. Yep, they're advancing automatically. Can I get any closer? Not really. Okay. Let's go with this. Well, you've got pretty good stuff. End of round two, I. On that side of the wall? I don't know. Well. With pleasure. Let's go ahead and uh, choose the walk again. Oh. Weird. Alright, well, unfortunately the rats are... ...deciding not to, um... ...position themselves nicely for us to, uh, take them all out easily. It shall be so. These guys move pretty fast. Right, there's got to be another guy right behind the wall. I need to uh, do a little bit of healing. All right, so apparently the green uh, circles indicate that uh, it's guaranteed to uh, succeed, and the higher I go, the more likely it is to fail. So let's switch to Very stick well. with that. If you say so. Go ahead and move. There we go. Oh boy, there's an 
There's yet another one. Can I get around you? Nope. Eh, push, push! You're not gonna let me get around you, are you? Good enough healing. Okay, let's keep trying to move. Unfortunately, these rats are really fast. Yep, there it goes. And there are more rats behind on the other side of the wall. Well, I mean, I guess this just means that everyone has an opportunity to uh, murder it directly. Eh, whatever. Apparently this is the uh, the only rat left. There we go. Good enough. Our will has prevailed. Yeah, they, they were only rats. Uh, One thousand three hundred nineteen experience points. Oh, thrilling! I'm a firm believer. In Excellent. All right, uh, let's go with more speed. And what else do I want? Uh, strength is probably really good. Let's go with that. Oh, that's right. Fifth level, you get uh, you get some spells. Um, almost tempted to uh, go for light, just so that uh, we can get the uh, uh, skill up with fire. So... Yeah, let's do that. Alright, uh, I need to... I suppose I don't need to bump that up. Critical strike, dual weapons, close combat. That seems like a good idea. Bobo also gains a level. more senses. Let's just even out speed there. And a couple points in dexterity. Uh, I want I wanted uh, speed to be a nice even 50 there. Alright, and you also uh, get spells. Um, heal wounds, itching skin, stamina. I think heal wounds, just getting more healing is probably going to be a, a good choice. Get a bit more mythology, a bit more bow, and a bit more ranged combat. Oh, actually, you know what? Don't need ranged combat as much as scouting. Let's go max that out. Experience is its own reward. All right, a bunch of stuff went up, so that's nice. Look at that! Okay, so we're gonna get some stuff out of these beds, it looks like. Oh, hey! Just walk on the beds. Hello! Little light. Okay, I, I was not expecting to just, like, jump. Potion of Cure Poison. Now, I am... Yeah, I'm clicking right to uh, put them into the, uh, the party inventory. Nothing there. Look at that! Hello! Smelling salts. Okay. Well, it's always fun to find uh, find things hidden in beds. So, do these do anything? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Oh, hey, we've got a door here that uh, I could I could probably uh, you know suffer another fall from when it closes on me. How does that work? Let's take a quick look at the map. 
Well, there is a way that way. Of course, I'm leaving the door open for, uh, like, monsters to come find me. I'm sure there's nothing wrong with that. Hmm. It does appear to be a monster out there. Hall of Meditation. Absolutely no magic allowed. Potential danger here. Okay, camouflaged creature spotted. Get him, boys! All right, let me just, uh... Actually, you know what? We're in a pretty good position right here, I think. Can you, uh... Can you breathe on them? You can. Be so. I like it. Yeah, we'll just, uh, pelt them with, uh, missile weapons. turn the camera every single time. Uh, I think that uh, breathing again would be a pretty good thing. It shall be so. Everyone seems pretty good on hit points. Um, I should probably just be casting a lot of spells just so that uh, I am... Yeah, you know what? Shrill, shrill sound. With pleasure. So that I'm like constantly trying to ch uh, train our music, uh, music magic, stamina. Don't really need that right now. That's light. Identify item. I'll just go with a bless. Very well. That worked. I like how fast you are, Island Wee. Not that the bless is gonna do a whole lot of good. Yeah, let's just go with this. It's fine. 908. Almost ranged combat skill increased. Alright, well, we've got some bookshelves. Ooh, that's actually kind of pretty. Although it also kind of looks like the light is going up towards it, which is a little bit weird. Now, I have not rebound my strafe keys, so I should probably do Look that. Look at That's that! What is it? A book! I like books. A spell book, unidentified. Well, let's go ahead and take that. These appear to be the books appear to be books about philosophy and metaphysics. Just reading the titles makes your head hurt. Oh, come on. That is, that's, that's not right. Would not make my head hurt. Is there something over here? There is. What is that? A magnifying glass. Oops. Uh, it's a gadget, so I assume this would be if we had a gadgeteer, and since we don't, it's not really going to be doing us any good. Um, nope. Alright, well, uh, you know, for now, let's, uh, let's go ahead and do a little bit of curing. Very well. I'm afraid it's not possible. Wait, what? Did we get into combat? Before you can cast your spell, a ghostly choir of voice whispers, Shh, your spell fizzles. Oh, that's right. They said no magic here. I guess it's a dead magic area. Grab that. I will. You don't need to tell me that. Another uh, unidentified spell book. I heard that. History of the books of this shelf bear titles such as The History of the Rapax Wars, Prophecy in Modern Times, and Technology and Chain in Higardi Society. There's a door here. A specific item is required here. Hmm. Grab that. Potion of moderate stamina. 
That's not too bad. The books on this shelf all seem to refer to cosmic lords and someone or something called Fun Zhang. You know, I kind of hope that the range of the light spell increases as we uh, use uh, use power. Alright, so I'm not seeing anything else in the corners. What about on the tables? There's a book here. And so the lords populated Dominus with all manner of creatures, wise and foolish, weak and strong, beautiful and hideous. We, the Higardi, play a special role, for it is said that we will populate the new world when the ascension comes. Sounds like a doomsday cult to me. There is no upper level here. Okay. Okay, so the door leads out to there. Where does it lead? Uh, probably actually leads to there. Yeah, uh, wait. Let's look again. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it leads, uh, leads to there. Look at that! Grab that! Another cleaver. I'll take a look at that in a moment. Ooh, hello. Uh, main gauche. I'll take that. Grab that. Ah, throwing knives. Yes. Ah, uh, you cannot use throwing knives. Well, in that case, uh, let's unequip. Let's actually put this in here. Let's give you throwing knives, since you can use them. Might need more arrows. You've got a bunch. Uh, you've got the crossbow. Three to eleven, minus one to hit, minus two to initiative, two to eight. Eh. I suppose being a little bit slower might not be so bad. We'll try it out. Well, also, I did just remember that uh, someone did tell me that there was uh, something that I did miss. So I'll go go back and take a look at that back in the lower thing. Only just remembered it now. Nothing there. Can I do anything with these? Nope. Do not overcook. Hmm. I wonder if I could put something in there. Maybe. I wonder if I can cast in here. Present. I can. Well, that's handy. Okay, Book of Blessings, Spell Bless. For those who study from the Divine Spellbook, this tome communicates all knowledge required to cast the Bless spell. Um, so Lord, Valkyrie, Priest, and Bishop. So I could actually uh, sell this. Oh, I can cast Identify from right here. I'm afraid it's not possible. Oh, shucks. And are you out of that now? 
Yep. Alright, well, for now... Let's do that. I suppose I could yes. rest in here. Eh, I'll, I'll try to do that, like, in between episodes. Just grind up spell points and stuff a little bit. That is just a light. Alright, so it looks like we're gonna need a key for that door. Ah, yes, this door did close on its own. A little bit creepy, but... Okay. This lot will be child's play. Oh, hi! A guardy raider? And a guardy bandit. Am I in a... In a decent place? Okay. What should we cast? We've got Shrill Sound. I've got Energy Blast. With pleasure. With pleasure. Okay. Very well. We'll go with Bless. That's right, I got you light. You've got heal wounds. Okay. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. We'll do that. Uh, all. I cannot put you in Berserk yet. Alright. That's fine. That didn't work. No, wait, it did. Sleep. Well, that was fun. I like how we just get 36 gold. Just, you know. Uh, it, it's like a. Um, it just magically appears in our wallet. Uh, you are a s you are asleep. It shall be so. So let's go ahead and just murder you. Why not? Um, let's play with frost a little with bit. With pleasure. With pleasure. Also, do you have anything like attacking? Should totally be able to use light to blind people, but that's not the case. All right, that's fine. No longer asleep. That's fine. We'll get some uh, range skill trained up here. It's down to 26 uh, hit points. Uh, let's see. I can try to put him to sleep again. I can do a shrill sound. Do magic missile. With pleasure. Haven't tried that. There he comes in. And he immediately <laughs> dies. That was fun. I've gotten so much more experience out of the uh, the rats than these two guys, though. Uh, I do like the, uh, you know, taking some opportunities to... Uh, get some... I like this floor. I want this floor. Well, it would probably be really cold in uh, winter. Right. Unidentified powder. It's flash powder. A long staff. It's just a quarter staff. Blue potion. Potion of moderate healing. And ten throwing knives. Oh. Yes. Well. Let's take those. It looks very shiny. Very golden. I can't look at any of those. So those have been our, our first human opponents. Um, doesn't appear to be anything else in here, though. Okay. I 
All right, well, let's go back the other way. And there was this passageway here. Oh, actually, it is about time to end the episode. So I'm going to run back to... Oh, that's right, there's stairs there. That is a really creepy sound. There is something inside there. I should check my key bindings to see if there's a jump option. I feel like there's something that's sh in here. What is that? A ramp to get out in case we get trapped in there or something? I don't know. Uh, anyway, uh, I'm going to go actually back down to the lower monastery because I think someone said that I missed something down there. So I'm going to go look, and when we return, hopefully I will be there and have found it. See you then, everyone.